call the center court cliff. Still giving those arms a break. Got 10 seconds left. Five seconds. And she goes on to the cliffhanger. Looking good here. On to this birdhouse. Got hold of it. We saw Nick Patel crush this course in demo. We know it's doable. Yes, good transfer. Oh, it just runs out of gas there. What a run from Kelly Wolfborough. Just cruises through the first three obstacles. Not a bad start. We'll see if our next runner now, can overtake. Starting block, he is a 40-year-old Air Force veteran and mother of four from Austin, Texas. Representing Austin Ninjas, please put your hands together for Christy Brophy! Brophy, underway here on stage three. Good start. There we go. Oh, she's cruising through vertical adventure. Oh, come on. Looks for the transfer. Got it. Watch out, because this will tilt on you. Nice. Got a hold of it. Got to move that other arm over. No! Oh, she was so close. She had the right hand on it. Just couldn't bring her weight down, and it flipped over. Our first gentleman athlete to attack. The Ninja Program at Gymnastic Academy of Boston at 41 years of age from Shrewsbury, Massachusetts, representing Ultimate Obstacles in West Boylston. Please give it up for Eric Loazzo. Loazzo, ready to go. Getting the go-ahead from Meisner. Countdown underway. Can he break new ground on stage three? A good start on vertical adventure. Good transfer. Now this tough move up. Oh, and he lachets it. Great job. Transfers down to the second tablet. And Loazo cruises onto the cliffhanger. Remember, the championship is out of play. But Strongest Ninja absolutely in contention. 15 seconds left of rest. Remember, this is a monster obstacle. You can tell those ledges are not thick. He's moving quickly to the end of the third ledge. Reaches over. He's got the grab. Here's a 180 degree transfer and it's not going to be easy. Oh no. I wanted to see more engagement of the thumbs on that. Like I said earlier, Nick Patel crushed now this in demo. He ha it can be done. He is a 40 year old iron worker from Brooklyn, New York. Representing none but himself. Give it up. For Kenny Edwards! Phil, let me know when we're back up. Are we good? Good? Welcome back. This is Kenny Edwards. Sorry, the stream went down. A little bit of technical Ooh. issues. Edwards on stage three. He did very well in stage two. Ooh. Oh no! Oh, he reached up for this first tablet. He got, he touched it, which cleared the obstacle. That's an issue. A three-year-old software engineer from Huntsville, Alabama, and he trains anywhere he can get in. Put your hands together for Joe Joe Bottom. 
me know if we get that guy. Yeah. Okay. Here's JoJo. Ready to go. This is his second time in stage three in NNL. The first five years ago. And he has still got it. Placing both hands on each other. A little bit of a risky move. Oh. Thinks about disengaging the chuck. Oh, he goes back. He's in trouble. Buying him. He's, go he's swinging wildly. Trying to correct himself. He reaches over. No. Oh. And with that, we're down to one. Just one left. No, and but we're now, last but certainly not least, he is a 48-year-old financial advisor and brain tumor survivor from Columbus, New Jersey, representing the Moot Lab from Haynes Court, New Jersey. Please give it up for Clint the Smiling Ninja, Sarion. Sarion has the support of the entire crowd, including Larry Simmons on the sideline. Sarion had the fastest clear on stage one. He secured the championship in stage two. He's doing this for his training partner, Travis. Couldn't be here today because his mother was in the hospital. But I think Clint has done just fine for himself here. Looks like we got a, got a little bit of a technical issue with an obstacle. Might be something with the support on Tablet Crossing, I think. <laughs> We're just whacking it. Are we good? Hey, welcome back. Uh, I'm sorry the stream has been being crazy. Uh, don't worry. We recorded everything, and there will still be an upload of it. You won't miss any of the action. Check in soon enough, and it'll be on the YouTube channel. Clint Sarion, our last runner in Stage 3. So far, nobody has made it past the cliffhanger. Eric Loazzo and Kelly... Oh, what's their last name? Luffborough. The only two to make it to the cliffhanger. Everybody else has come undone at Tablet Crossing. Clint crushes it. Great move. I think at this point, Clint's secured strongest ninja. He's led in every stage. But now he gets his 30 seconds of rest before tackling the center court cliff. And he leaps straight to the first ledge 15 seconds into the rest period. Oh, he's eager to go here. Clint looks strong. Here's a big 180. He's got the reach. A big lateral move now. No! Oh, Clint Sarian. What an effort. Farther than anybody in stage three. He was the fastest in stage one, the fastest in stage two. Ladies he crushes in stage three. That concludes the Masters Division of the National Ninja League Season 6 World Championships. Awards will be at 3 o'clock, 3 p.m. That is 24 minutes from right now. They will be at that lovely awards podium set up right in the middle between the first and second stages and the third stage. During the break, we strongly encourage you to head over to our lovely refreshments pavilion.
thank you guys so much for watching. I know that we've had a little bit of technical trouble. I think Phil has something to say. Yeah, um, yeah, sorry about that. So what happened was, um, so we had to move everything from one desk to the other, and that was a very uh, strenuous it was process. A, yeah, it was a tumultuous process. Yeah, and, uh, and so uh, the one thing that ended up, so then we started the stream, it was working fine, but it was super laggy because it was, we were accidentally on, wi on, my, on my phone hotspot Wi-Fi somehow. And then... <laughs> Uh, and then I'm like, oh man, and then I'm like, alright, we gotta connect to Ethernet, so slowly, I was just trying to rush through that, and then, then YouTube was being stupid and wouldn't let us, uh, restart the stream and all that, and I tried to record locally, I got part, most, I got most of it, um. Yeah, so don't worry, and, uh, and also we're gonna have a VOD uploaded. And also we have, uh, GoPro footage if yeah. there's anything we missed. Um, yeah. so yeah, sorry about that, guys. Um. You're not gonna miss every, anything if you tune, yeah. if you keep an eye out on the channel. All right. Lesson learned, check the Ethernet port. <laughs> um, yeah. Hey, we got seven more days. Yep. Yeah, so thanks a lot, guys, for tuning in today. It's been a blast. Uh, so, I will be here for the next two days, and then, after that, we're going to have Alex Cunningham joining Philip Scott for the rest of the days. Alex, of course, our, uh, our veteran commentator. So, I'd say today was pretty successful. Oh, look at that. Let's go, Kenny. Yeah. So, we'll see you tomorrow for adults and two days from now for young adults. Until then, my name's Jake Phillips. He is Philip Scott. He is not saying anything. Yeah, it's me. <laughs> That's debatable. Let me just put up the final yeah. uh, thing. There we go. As you can see, the, those are the final. Yep. I'm going to go ahead and three. sign off now. I think the stream might stay up for another minute or two. Yeah, so. Thank you all so much for watching. We'll see you tomorrow. Have a good day.